Hi guys, this is IGCSE O level chemistry, paper 22, June 2018, question 31. Ammonia is manufactured by reacting hydrogen and nitrogen in the Haber's process. Which row describes the sources of hydrogen and nitrogen and the conditions used in the manufacture of ammonia in the Haber's process? So source of hydrogen is not air, it is from natural gas. So options A and B have been eliminated. Then the source of nitrogen is from the fractional distillation of air. The temperature for the reaction is 450 to 500 degrees Celsius. And the pressure is 200 atmospheres, eliminating option C and making option D the correct option for this question. Question 32. Which statements about the carbon cycle are correct? Carbon dioxide is added to the atmosphere by respiration. Yes, respiration produces carbon dioxide. Carbon dioxide is added to the atmosphere by combustion of coal. Combustion of coal produces carbon dioxide and water. Carbon dioxide is removed from the atmosphere by photosynthesis. Photosynthesis is a reaction in which carbon dioxide and water react together to form glucose and release oxygen gas. So since all three statements are correct, option A is the correct option for this question. Question 33. Which row describes the uses of sulfur and sulfur dioxide? Sulfur dioxide is used in the manufacture of sulfuric. Sulfur, sulfur is used in the manufacture of sulfuric acid, but not in the extraction of aluminum. Whereas sulfur dioxide is used as a food preservative and not in the treatment of water. Therefore, the correct option for this question is option C. Question 34. Limestone is used in many industrial processes. In which process is it not used? Manufacture of alkenes. Manufacture of alkenes is by cracking of higher fraction hydrocarbons, not by the use of limestone. Manufacture of cement. Limestone is used in making cement. Manufacture of iron. It is used to remove acidic impurities during the manufacture of iron. And manufacture of lime. Upon uh, thermal decomposition, limestone produces line. Therefore, A is the correct option for this question. Question 35. What is not the correct use of the fraction name? Fuel oil is used for making waxes. No, 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 no. Lubricating oil would be used for Making wax is not fuel oil. This is incorrect. Gas oil is used as fuel in diesel engines. Yes. Kerosene is used as a jet fuel. Yes. Naphtha is used in making chemicals. Yes. So, the correct option for this question is option A. Question 36. Which statement about alkenes is not correct? They decolorize aqueous bromine. Yes, they do. They only contain the elements carbon and hydrogen. Yes, they are hydrocarbons. They react with hydrogen to form alkanes. Yes, hydrogen is added onto alkenes to form alkanes. They react with steam to produce carboxylic acids. No, they react with steam to produce alcohol. So, option D is the correct option for this question. Question 37. Which substances can be obtained by cracking hydrocarbons? Ethanol and ethene. Ethene can be obtained, not ethanol. Ethanol and hydrogen. Ethanol cannot be obtained. Hydrogen can be obtained. Ethene and hydrogen can both be obtained. Ethene can be obtained. Polyethene cannot be obtained. Therefore, C is the correct option for this question. Question 38. Two processes used for the large-scale production of ethanol are shown. A compound containing carbon, hydrogen, and oxygen is used to produce ethanol. This is process 1. In process 2, a compound containing carbon and hydrogen only is used to produce ethanol. So, in 1, ethanol is produced from C6H12O6. That is fermentation. And in 2, it is produced from c 2 H4, which is addition of steam. 
So which statement is correct? Process one uses a renewable starting material, yes, sugar cane. Process one is done at a very high temperature, no, at temperatures between 30 and 40 degrees Celsius. Process two involves fermentation, no, it involves addition of steam. Process two is done at room temperature, no, it is done at temperatures of 60 degrees Celsius and pressures of 300 atmospheres. Therefore, the correct option for this question is option A. Question 39. What is the name of the organic product of the reaction shown? CH3, CWH plus CH3, CH2OH. This will give an ester. CH3, C double bond O, single bond O. This part comes from the carboxylic acid. And we will continue. Actually, the oxygen here will come from the alcohol. So I'll represent the alcohol with a different color. So this O comes from CH3, CH2OH, bonded to CH2, and then CH3. So the name of this ester would be ethyl. And this part is called ethanoate. So the ester is called ethyl ethanoate, which results in option A being the correct option for this question. Question 40. Which two compounds react together to form a condensation polymer? So compound A is uh, an alcohol with two OH groups and a carboxylic acid with one CWH group. So this will not form a polymer. This can only react once. In B, we've got an alcohol, a diol reacting with an amine. So they will not react. In C, we've got a diol reacting with a diamine. So alcohols and amines do not react. In D, we have got a diol reacting with a dioic acid. So two OH group on one uh, monomer and two CWH group on the other monomer. This will result in formation of a polyester. Therefore, option D is the correct option for this question.